What's up guys, this is James over at lovelybest.com and today we're doing a review of the Air Jordan 7 uh, Air Jordan 7 DB Dorn Becker uh, or the Air Jordan Dorn Becker 7 so here I have let me just check so right now we have the box it came in the blue box and I just want to show you here these are the labels and of course it's a size 12 it says Air Jordan 7 Retro uh, style number 898651-15. Now the cover of the box uh, says Thornbecker Freestyle. Right there. And here. Now the inside of, sorry, the, the back right here. I mean the, the, the the lower part of the box you have these credentials there and the inside of the cover lid of the box tells Damien's story so I, I'm sure you're all familiar with Damien Phillips um, age 10 diagnosis hem, hem, hemophilia a severe uh, type of uh, cancer I think now this shoe is dedicated to him it isn't easy to live with a severe bleeding disorder but Damien isn't about to let the let it stop him so uh, when this ambitious 10 year old isn't dreaming of playing in the NBA he's he loves playing his guitar Damien's undeniable enthusiasm for life can be summed up for his uh, his favorite uh, Michael Jordan quote just play have fun enjoy the game so that's basically what it says here and you can catch that there so the wrapping paper is printed with silver freestyle prints and one blue freestyle on the Nike swoosh logo. So you can see that here. I'm just about to set it up so you can see it completely. Now, so here the shoe comes in all black and red overall color uh, high quality leather uh, was used and it's very soft to touch so as you can see I'm trying to get the best angle of the camera right there so now the black part is a little harder material made of leather maybe uh, there's some kind of smoky, silvery, random pattern on it. Um, I guess it is, it's trying to depict, it, well, it's depicting the sound waves coming off an electric guitar. So very unique and a special design. It's also very shiny and has some it has something a rock star would wear uh, when he when he goes to a or when he goes to play basketball. Now the Golden Jumpman logo in metal. Um, is shiny uh, and the midsole uh, the gold mountain design gold mountain design the rest of the midsole is in black and uh, there's the bluish icy outsole and there are perforations of various sizes on the upper right here so so you can see that now the medial side, the black part made up of the is made of the, of the majority of space on the midsole. It, uh, I guess, it's trying to provide better arc arc support. So you can see that there. Now at the back, the pull tab is very extravagant and plush. Uh, resembles something like a stage decoration of a rock band it's got those dots up so it changes color when it hits the light now the inside of the pull tab uh, also has this feature again paying attention to detail now showing you the inner tab as you can see And the side panel. The side panel is thinner than other uh, Air Jordan models, uh, but it's this, it is made of the same strong material. Uh, still give adequate 
uh, ankle protection, of course, when you're playing. Now, there's there is a padded uh, the, he the the heel is is padded, the padded heel cushion, and the back of the heel features the upside down guitar, again in a reference of Damon's hobby. Now, the DJP DJP is his initials, and you probably know this. Now, the stitching at the edge uh, is well controlled. Uh, checking the overall stitching, making sure there are no flaws. And they seem to be on point all the way. So you can see the tumble leather is sort of in a red, but it fades into black. Uh, it has that look. And we have the laces, which are ordinary laces uh, with gold metal uh, aglet at the tip. So they're basically just ordinary flat laces, and they have these gold metal aglets right there, which is perfect, which is a perfect touch considering the design, the overall design of the shoe. Okay, again, this is the Air Jordan DB7 or Dorn Becker 7. Now, as you can see that, I hope that's clear enough. Now, on top of the tongue at Jordan, now normally there's an air in between the Jordan, but for the freestyle version, it says DJP. Again, Damien's initials, pretty awesome for a 10 year old. Uh, and then at the front, sorry, just checking the side again. Now, just want to go back to these areas. But at the front of the toe box here, there's a guitar pick decoration with small golden flickering spots. Uh, so you can see that with the DJP, again, in reference to Damien's hobby, which is, of course, playing the guitar or wanting to be a basketball superstar. Now, at the f oh, sorry. The crown jewel design of the DB is on the outsole. Now featuring a cartoon version of Damien uh, playing the guitar with 23 on it. And it, it's also wearing the Air, well he's also wearing, in this cartoon is also wearing the Air Jordan DB. Uh, Air Jordan 7 DB combining the right and the left shoe. It says super explosive. So super up top and explosive down there uh, at the heel part. You can see that. There you go. It's got that 23 on the guitar. As you see at the back of the shoe, this is exactly what it's replicating. And he's wearing the Air Jordan 7 DBs too. As a cartoon. There you go. It's a beautiful, beautiful touch. Would you look at that? So... There you go. And now let's go ahead and pull out the shoe tree. Just want to see what it came with. And it came with this ordinary shoe tree. It's made out of cardboard like most Jordans come. Uh, you'd be surprised because how special the shoe is and that's all it came with. Uh, but still, it's still a pretty awesome shoe, even without the shoe tree. Now, the insole, one on the left is, the shoe is saying, just play, have fun. And on the right insole, it's, it says, enjoy the game. That is MJ's coat, uh, and MJ's coat, and the kid really likes it. There you go. Enjoy the game. Now, the underside, as you can see there, just play, have fun, enjoy the game. Now, the underside of the insole is, let me show you, it's very sticky, very difficult to pull out, and even harder to put back in. So I guess you don't have, you don't do that without a proper reason, so... Now stitching on the inside, I want to show you stitching on the inside. There you go. There you have it. Here's the other pair. 
perfectly done. See how the stitching isn't too far apart and it has attention to detail. So here's a full 360 degree view bef before we go ahead and call it a day. So here's a full lateral view and a full back view. See how beautiful that is? Nice. Here's a full lateral view again and the full front view. So I want to know what you guys think. Please leave me a comment, uh, like this video, and uh, share it, and subscribe for more updates. We'll be back with more updates. Till then, you guys take care again. Uh, AJ7DB.